Hi, I'm Barry from Boom Community Arts and in today's video we're going to show you how to make a Christmas candle lantern. It's quick and easy and you don't even need to worry about getting wax in the carpet. Right, so here is what we're going to need. We are going to need an A3 open top and side folder or just an A3 bit of frosted plastic of some sort, an A5 bit of coloured plastic, if you don't have a bit of coloured plastic you can just get a bit of clear plastic and colour it in with a pen. Speaking of pens, we will need some for decorating it, we shall also need some sellotape, some lights and a pair of scissors. So to begin, I'm going to cut this edge and this edge to give me just a single A3 sheet. Save this bit for another one. There we go. So here we are. On a free sheet. Now, what we want to do is, we want to roll it into a sort of tube shape, and what you guys see is there's going to be a lot extra. We're going to cut that off, but don't throw it away because we're going to use that in just a moment. as it says, don't throw this away. And now, what we'll do is, we're going to decorate up this part. If we're going to do it, decorate it up. Dark colours are better, because they'll show up better on the transparency. This is dry, we are going to take our cell tape roll it around and place the bit there. extra secure you can always put a bit of tape in the inside as well. Stand nicely. There we are. Okay now the part we put aside for earlier on what we're going to do is we're going to cut some wavy lines in it to make it look like the wax is melting down.
Okay, and once you've finished cutting out your wax strips, what we're going to do is we are going to stick this in place on the top. Just a little bit, just so it makes it look a bit more few dimension. There we are. Put that to the side now. What we want to do is take our yellow piece of plastic and we just want to cut we flame shape in. But what we want to do is we want to make sure there's enough space at the bottom so we can attach it to the front of our candle. Fold them in half and then fold them in half again. I'm going to put a little bit of tape just up here to hold it all together. This and let them all hang down and to the back of the can. I'm going to take this one up here so it keeps them from falling all down the bottom. Bye.